Hey everybody, welcome to the Golden Goblin. I don't know what day it is today. I mean, I know it's a Wednesday, but I mean, that's, I think, uh, this is day six. I'm not ready to leave, dude. I'm not ready to leave after the pogs we had in the last episode. Can we just re recount what happened there? Someone got the jump on us. We posted up and destroyed them. We got killed. Went to the gulag. Send someone to the Shadow Realm with the Rick Grimes. Got sniped. Coming back in on the drop. Hold up in a building. Set a counter ambush. And ended the man's life. Then got insanely greedy. Trying to hit a guy 300 meters away with a burst fire. Uncommon tier FAMAS. And had someone sneak up on us with a pistol and destroy us, which honestly, like, is a thousand percent my own fault. But, dude, we learned a lot. We had a great time. Remember that? It's like the, my brick killed a man with a trident uh, moment. Remember when we shot a rocket launcher at that helicopter? We should have aimed higher, but you know what? We learned a valuable lesson. I'm, I'm a hands-on learner. That was by far our best game. We came in 30th place, which is, like, the top... Uh, I mean, there's 150 people per game, so, well, roughly. Um, so we're talking about, like, you know, top 20%. And that was not a top 20% where we hid the whole time. Did we hide? Yeah, but we hid not because we were like, oh, I've got a golden shotgun. We hid because we landed and we're picking up little scraps off the ground and shoving it into our vest. And then, you know, SEAL Team 6 was going to raid the building. I only had, I had to use guerrilla warfare tactics to even stand a chance. So I, I stand by it. I stand by it. Ask not what you can do for your squad, but what your squad can do for you. That's not how that quote goes. Okay, you son of a gun. You ready for this? Um, we're going up. Uh, Q. Oh, flare is left mouse button. Okay, so here's the thing. Now we look for boys. Oh god, I'm getting rattled. Now we look for boys in the air. You can't hurt me. And we try to chop them up. Oh my god, with the sensitivity, this is a little funky. Okay, so here's what you do. You see this guy right here? I'm sorry, sir. It's gonna be a bad day for you. Ooh! <laughs> oh, da da Look at this dude. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, baby. Okay, where are we dropping, boys? Um, Honestly, Lammy in uh, A&E's most profitable television program ever, Storage Town, USA. We'll have to make some big moves. I mean, this is a spicy circle. It only, like, leaves a quarter of the map in here. Um, so we're probably want to drop maybe when it's around. So let's see. Well, we want to drop maybe, like, right as the circle intersects with this line. Would be my guess. So probably, like, three, two, one, go. Not bad. Okay. Now, do we need to pull here? That's a great question, and the answer is for sure. So let's do that early so we can also get a little glimpse. We get a little glimpse around us of who else might have the audacity to land in A&E. That is, yeah, Storage Wars is an A&E property. TLC traffics a little bit more in, in human misery and awkwardness. A&E is just kind of like, eh, people are buying stuff. Enemy dropping into the AO. Oh, no kidding. Okay, shove this into your vest. We have a gun. I believe it's an SMG. You hear that? You hear that? Might just be the sound of a car on fire. Yo, it's another... Yo, a silence! The Parabellum! 
Jonathan. I hear glass breaking. I will not break glass. I want him to know we're here. Maybe he's listening to music right now. I do kind of want to get him. I don't know ex exactly where he was. You'd love to, like, hear... Oh, it's a thermal. What? You'd love to hear people fight before we start to fight. These are not the contracts I want. I really like, like, a scavenger contract if possible. Okay, so, you know, be careful. We expect it to be kind of hot as we get moving here. Here's my rule. Right now, I have a legendary weapon. We will use the legendary instead of the uncommon. The uncommon is our backup. Well, no one's been here because there's cash on the ground. There's also a buy station real close. M4 is kind of tempting, but maybe not at uh, neutral tier. I believe Dead Silence has us move in uh, silent like lasagna. Yo, the beef eater? Sure. Dun, 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 dun. So you can swap like this for close range. I'll admit, I'm so ignorant for firearms related uh, things. I actually have no idea what a semi-auto is. I believe that means we have to tap fire, but we can tap fire quickly. Now, number one thing, I think if I could just teach myself a little bit more composure and just not panicking when things, whoops, <laughs> when things start to get a little hairy, I would be so much better off. There we go. Whoa! UAV. Okay, pop that right away. Silenced SMG. I think we're okay with that. Use that UAV, please. Yo, that's good. So we know we're relatively safe. So at, at this point, we've leveraged our UAV. Knowing that we're safe, honestly, take me to this buy station. And let me get a... Let me get another UAV. I know that's cowardice to some extent, but... Uh, when we could have gotten a precision kill streak. Or precision airstrike. But um, I think to, to keep me safe in solos when we don't have the benefit of, you know, extra pairs of eyeballs. Seems like a sensible approach to me. So we'll probably, we'll wait on this. I don't think there's any reason to go pop it, you know, too early or anything like that. Stay fresh, you know? It's hard to stay fresh. We didn't get into combat early. Oh, we, I didn't even realize we have a, people have a bounty against us right now. So that thing you see where it says protect Northern Lion. This is a great chance for us to get cash, by the way. As that threat level increases, we will uh, run the risk of enemies being closer and closer. So I popped the UAV, and I, don't, I can't believe I'm talking tactics. I popped the UAV so I could take this supply contract and maybe get some serious capital without really being at risk. And we're, we're close enough to the circle. So this is basically just a big cash injection. There are perks that make it so people don't show up on your UAVs, by the way. But that's basically like, if someone's going to be that good, then for sure. You got me. Congrats. <laughs> if someone's got that perk already, by all means. You beat me. Straight up. So we just want mad capital. and Because you know what? If we get mad capital, we could buy another UAV. I love not having to use my own awareness to know where enemies are. Not to mention, we're just getting, you know, loot from these as well. I think, I'm not sure if all of them end up being legendaries, but... Now, just stay cool. I can feel the, the anxiety a little bit. Those steps were definitely close. What the heck is that? Armor satchel? <laughs> oh, the Joker, dude! But do I want to... 
Do I want to take this? Because we already have some great stuff. Recon. Secure location. I actually don't know what this is. And I'll tell you, I'm about to succeed in my objective, too. So the Joker, I think... I mean, a legendary rocket launcher is a cool idea for sure. But I think we already have great weapons. Next contract bonus, 80%. Yeah, just run through the middle of the road. What's the worst that could happen, dude? Shots somewhat close. But you know what? We can hold up in this building. We've been moving a lot. We really... Oh. Um. No. 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 No! It crashed! Client commando... Client command overflow. That is obviously not our golden goblet performance. Because I had the audacity to step in a bush while having the greatest loot run of all time. That's painful, dude. That's painful. You know what though? We 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 had uh we had fun, legitimately had fun on that one. We did not fire our weapon once, but we were gonna. At least once to win the game. I'm telling you with authority. That would have been a solid... At least top 10. If we underperformed, that was a top 10 finish. If we performed at our level of expectation, easy win. If we pogged out of our mind, probably 30 or 40 kills. I'm just saying it. Now, what am I thinking this time? Um, don't mess with it, you know? Follow, follow the same kind of procedure. Really, that's my fault for running into foliage. It's a coward strategy. I should have known it would lead to a coward's end. A client command overflow. The most cowardly of all endings. It hurts. It hurt. When you get so many legendaries and they just rip you out of existence. When you try so hard and you don't succeed. But I think, you know... Ooh, jeez Louise. Just our limited performance there tells you everything you need to know. Like, I, I think we were we were clearly in it for the long haul. <laughs> we should not stand still, but who cares if you get killed in the pregame lobby? Hey, land over here. Land over here, you jerks. I can't kill you from here. I, I'm telling you, we would have had some hits there. Okay. Where are we landing? I'm not treating this like we have to go spicy because the last run was fast. Or the last run was yeeted. Oh, this is one heck of a circle. Honestly, I think we try to land in uh, the shopping mall. Oh, oh, my mouse. I love the way he walks out. I'm ready. I'm ready for the battle royale, boys. NL, how do you move your shoulders like that without moving your head? It's called stability, sweetheart. It's called 10 years of gym class in publicly funded education schools, sweetheart. Now, Promenade East, I, I honestly, I'm in the wrong tax bracket to shop there. I can't afford it. Promenade West, that's more for me. Okay. And I think this time, you just, you hit the ground running. No, don't let, dude, that's the boutique shops. That's the boutique shops, they're not for me. Oh, no. There's definitely some heat here. I'm thinking if we can land on the rooftop of the Best Buy. I'll settle for the brick, that's okay. These are Canadian references. Okay, stay frosty. Beautiful. A purple sniper. The corpse marker. Don't need that. So you know what I'm thinking. The next step... Is to go... Well... Close quarters AR! Legendary! 
That scared the crap out of me. The next step is to get up on this rooftop. And not get shot in the head. We oh, we have 90 shots for it now. Let's go. For, for our backup weapon. What kind of scope we got here? Oh, baby. An advanced thermal scope. An advanced thermal scope with 8x capabilities. I kind of want to go over to this other roof. Come on, come on. <laughs> I feel safe on the roof. Oh, what? Someone was here, dude. Someone was freaking here. Stay cool. Genuinely stalk your prey in the night. We know he's out there. I hear him. Think I hear him? Or is that just the freezer? Dude, I think it's the cash register. <laughs> but we know he's around here. My thinking... He's not going to leave this with a juicy building right in his AO. He's, he drove his car here. He's going to get all this stuff. Then when he leaves, he's going to go one more building. And then we go. Can we get that one more time? How do you feel about that? By the way, how do I have zero cash? I didn't even know that was possible. So just don't let your neurons... Ice over. I really don't want to bust out of here. He might not get in the car again. I mean, this is cowardly. But I kind of got myself into this position by being a coward. He's in the car. We're, okay. Okay. Well, he's just, he's just gone. Alright. I really, I really didn't think he had it in him to just leave. It's okay, we get more loot opportunities. I'm realizing, you know, there's... Yo, wasn't that like right next to me? I thought that contract was like right next to me. So hold on, I know we want loot, but... Just take me upstairs for a second. Frag grenade. Very nice. Boot camp. Open 10 caches. Every tell you I used to call them caches? I don't even know if in French they're called caches. But that's what I used to call them. You hear movement? Oh! How could I not? I hit the truck! <laughs> Look, that's never gonna get a kill. But if you don't take a shot on that, you're a bigger coward than I am. If such a thing is even possible. I don't know how close the recon contract was. I mean, once you get 
a thermal scope, I think you begin the creep. That's that's my thoughts on this. I don't mind looting a little bit more. Because quite frankly, I think we could use... I mean, more cash is a given. Um, and a second frag, maybe, could come in handy. Um, I think the big thing we want, for sure, is more sniper ammo, if possible. I think we just got it. Yeah, okay. More armor plates, you know, it comes in handy if we survive an engagement. Oh my. Stopping power rounds. So you load those up right away. I do like the idea of the silenced AR, but we already have a legendary AR. I don't mind creeping the edge of the circle for now. That doesn't bother me. The UAV, I sleep. So I think we pretty much got what we wanted there. Did we get what we need? You're assuming I know what we need in this game. Which is a dangerous assumption because I have no idea. What have I done? Broke the door off its hinges? Ripped the dang hinges off. Oh! Oh! We First off, get to the safe side of the building. But secondly, there's someone over here. I think we do have to crack this first. That loadout drop is a honeypot, dude. Okay, where's our safe zone? It's close. It's close enough. He saw us. Oh my god. So, terrible shots with the sniper. Everything else, though? <laughs> Pretty good. Thermal silence they are? I don't know. Dude, how can I say no to the thing that we just crushed with? Don't even worry about reloading the sniper. I would also say, believe it or not, don't even worry about that loadout drop. We do have seven grand now. Keep ourselves in UAVs for weeks, boys. Now, I don't know a lot about stealth gameplay. Run. <laughs> don't, don't get in a window. Don't get in a window. Or an open door. Oh my god. Run. And shove some plates in your vest. How, how are we alive? I just, I'm just, I mean, you saw it. I just mashed buttons, dude. I think you got to take the ladder out. There's a fight going on. That fight, to me, means it's time for us to get the heck out of town. Get this safely as quick as possible. I'll tell you one thing. This gun rips. <laughs> so it's definitely, obviously, shooting over there. Um, you got to take a look. All right, if we see nobody, reload this sucker. One of these days, we're going to hit with it. So with 14,000, I mean, I would, <laughs> we should probably buy the loadout because we have uh, so much money. But I don't want to change my weapons. So what should you do? Well, fix your loadout. What about a self-revive? No, that doesn't make any sense. Let's buy the UAV. Should we buy more? I mean, probably. I'm sure the perks are worth a lot, don't get me wrong.
So what are we doing? Probably getting ourselves killed. Thanks for asking. It just gives us a little bit of confidence that we know we're somewhat safe. Be advised, UAV is bingo fuel. I'm going to wait till... I mean, this is just wasted money. I'm going to wait till the circle closes in a little bit more. Then I'm going to pop the UAV because I really think that could be a good money maker for us. So just take a little sip. Dun 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 dum 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 ticket ticket dum ticket ticket dum ticket dum take a little sip dum dum ticket ticket dum ticket ticket dum ticket dum We should get some of the kill streaks as well that are just like like precision airstrike is so good if you see a sniper on a roof and he shoots at you you just go and then he's dead but that assumes that he doesn't kill us before we can get it off Yo this gun rips dude Gas is getting mighty close. Come on, come on. You want the buy station. You know somebody wants this buy station. Thought I heard something. In solos, you must embody the rat. You must be like the rat. Okay, once we have the chance or are forced to move, that's where we're going to pop this UAV so we can move in relative silence like lasagna. Oops. Damn it, damn, 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 damn. Okay, now we move. UAV entering the AO. Where? You're telling me this man is in the gas. I thought I heard a parachute. <laughs> my my mistake. UAV is bingo fuel. RTB for resupply. I mean, there's a oh. Run. You know, no, no, no. Dude, I got the greatest. Idea. We only got 25 seconds. This has got to be so fast. Work with me. Precision airstrike. Airspace too crowded? What are you talking about? Get out your real weapon, by the way. Airspace too crowded. What a ripoff. Okay, we got to make extremely fast moves here. Little double sprint might be necessary. Dude, I would be so mad if I got killed in the way that I killed that guy. <laughs> but that's the law of the jungle, baby. Forty two remain. How do you? F I never know how to evaluate a spot when it comes to cover. I'm just always like, ooh, it's up high. So we're just trying to get a feel. Oh! No, I almost had him too. Oh, if only I wasn't hard scoped in. He was loaded out too. We did hurt him pretty good though. We hurt him pretty good. All right. Oh, that hurt. That it got the adrenaline pumping, but it hurt. It's all right, boys. Let's do it. We're in the gulag with the Rick Grimes. Where is he? I did not deserve that, but ladies and gentlemen, we have gotten it. Out thought. 
We outdot him. <laughs> okay. Where the heck would you want? First off, deploy this son of a gun. Uh, we want to be on the outer edge, near the TV station, I think. I think that's our best chance. <clears throat> Although, to be honest, I don't want to have to move into the circle. Ever. So I think I may actually land on this building and quite literally just camp till the end of the game. I 1000% expected to be looted, for the record. But I think that we're in real, like, you know, survival hours. Yo, you see what I see? And we're not safe. But we at least got some loot. Oh, you know why I realized we shredded that one guy so quickly? We had um, stopping power rounds in our gun. I was like, I wondered why he died so fast. I was like, man, this gun's incredible. It's not that it's not incredible. Oh, no. But it's also just that it's... Whoops, that's uh, my mouse wheel. <laughs> it's not that it's not incredible. It's just also... Uh, we had a little bit of resin working for us. How on earth is this unlooted? Um, goodbye, everybody. Stay frosty. Stay frosty. Obviously, somebody saw us move in here. I refuse to even crouch. Channel your inner strength. What are you doing? You're not going to convince me to leave. I'd rather die to the gas than feed you. Uh-oh. <laughs> no, I don't think that's an uh-oh. I think you just, just sit, dude. Just sit and wait. This was our plan to begin with. Can we just appreciate how nice it is to not have anti-aliasing when we aim down the sights, too? Or not have un-antis... Un-aliased antis? Un-antied aliases? That's not my blood, right? If I were this guy, what would I do? I would give up on me. What? Hope you're enjoying the video. <laughs> if you do, enemy, enemy UAV if you do enjoy me sitting still, best way to tell YouTube that you do is to That's click the like button. Helps me out a great deal. Sends a message to YouTube, hey, this guy makes good content. I'd like to see more of it in the future. Thank you. I don't hear that too much. Probably should have looted his weapons. I'm dead. <laughs> yeah, I guess looting his weapons wouldn't have made a difference. Look at this. Thing. Oh, he, he had me dead to rights, brother. He turned me into a thermal fart cloud. But 25th place? What do we get there? Five kills? Who is this man? Who is this man? For now, again, thanks for watching. Click the like button if you enjoyed the episode. If you watched all 34 minutes and 40 seconds of this, I'm going to assume that you enjoyed it or at least were compelled. If you did, click the like button. It's the best way to help support the channel and it's totally free. For now, thanks for watching. Subscribe if you want to see more in the future. I'll be in the comments soaking up dopamine. And of course, go give Malp and Dan your support as well. Go see how they did. But for now, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. See ya! I just got to click the stop recording button. See ya!